This is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I have got Jen Stiles with me. Welcome to FYI, Jen. Thank you. And welcome to Smith Falls. You're not uh, uh, you're not originally from Smith Falls. Maybe you can talk to a little bit about your background. Where are you from? I'm actually from Oxbridge, uh, which is about three and a half hours away, and uh, I lived there pretty much my whole life. So uh, we decided to look to buy because I'm a single mom with three kids and I couldn't afford Oxbridge. It was really expensive out there. And I had a friend that lived in Perth. So we came out this way and I found a little place I loved in Lombardy um, that I could afford. So we bought that about three years ago. And that brought you to the Smith Falls area. Now, who have you got here with you? <laughs> oh, this is Tank. <laughs> this is Tank. Hey, Tank. We, we, we like yeah. pets here on, on the FYI. <laughs> children, too, Thanks if you've got children. Fun. <clears throat> Bring your children yeah, on. So we like I that too. I have three kids. I have a 12 year old, 11 year old, and nine year old. All about have birthdays. So 10, 12, and 13 within the next few months. Wow. So it's been, wow. You yeah, are a busy yeah. lady. So I we're, actually we're have two older children as well, but they don't live with me and four grandbabies. Wow. That's yeah. amazing. That's amazing. How do you take, uh, we're going to talk about raise the curtains. Where do you find time? My goodness. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's right. Right now it's only uh, one evening a week for two hours. Uh, hopefully, once we grow, we can expand on that. All right. So we are talking about Raise the Curtains. Can you talk a little bit, tell the folks what it's about? Yeah. So the program is two hours a week at the uh, Trinity United Church. And it's all about singing, dancing. We do a little bit of gymnastics. And we just put on productions and just have a lot of fun. It's just where the kids can be comfortable and enjoy themselves. All right. So you're going to be putting on a production. So you, you right. meet once a week. So is it just like a drop-in type thing? No, so it is a program. Okay. They sign up. It's a year-long program. We run from September till June. We do several things throughout the year. So, like you said, Christmas, uh, Alice in Christmas Land, is Saturday and Sunday at the Trinity United Church, December 11th and 12th, I believe. Um, so the kids will be putting it on. On that's a lot of fun. It's really looking really cute. And then at the end of the year, we will have to find a bigger stage. We're not sure where yet to do the De Descendants, which is Disney. So that'll be a big one. That'll be a lot of fun. But the Alice in Christmas Land is going to be a lot of fun. There's going to be um, a hot chocolate bar, which is complimentary when you buy your ticket. So it's just about coming out and having a lot of fun for the afternoon. Excellent, excellent. So I, I just want to make sure I understand that you, you, all year you, you have uh, a program. Sorry, did you say once a week or twice a week? Once a week right now. Once a week. Tuesdays from 5.30 to 7.30. So all those children that are involved are going to be in the productions? That's right. Excellent, excellent. Yeah. All right, so how yeah. did you choose Alice in Christmas Land? Ah, uh, we just, there was a bunch and I just sat down with them and I read little scripts from each one. There was Wizard of Oz, there was just a whole bunch of different Christmas plays. We wanted to do something a little different. Uh, so I read different scripts and the kids all agreed on this one. I basically left it up to them. Excellent, now your background, your, your background is gymnastics and choreography? Yeah. Well, with gymnastics, I choreographed all the routines. So I have about 25 years experience with uh, provincial athletes and whatnot. Excellent, excellent. Now, how many yeah. how many people are, are in your program? How many children? We have about nine right now. Nine right now? Okay, and yeah. how do they uh, become involved? Like, is there, because you want them to so, be in? Yeah, go, yeah, sorry, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, I do have a Facebook page. A lot of people will just um, reach out to me on my Facebook page, and I invite them to come do a trial class and see how they like it and then just take it from there. If they want to sign up, great. Um, we always do a play. If I don't have enough spots for them, I will just create a spot, create something in the play. Yeah, so every child gets a, gets a spot and has their spotlight. All right, All right. and we, we did talk about gymnastics and choreography. Uh, music, is there vocal training, that type of thing going on too? Or oh, is it so speaking? at Raise the Curtains, I actually have a um, level 10 uh, Royal Conservatory of Music vocal coach and uh, I have her on Zoom and we do half an hour of that every single class. So they do get vocal lessons from a very qualified teacher, not me, <laughs> <laughs> the singing is not my thing, um, for half an hour each class. I said, what a great opportunity, you know, for, for even right now to, to have something to do, but especially for children that are thinking, you know, further down the line, that's what they want to do. More, more drama classes, more theatrical yeah. type things. It's a great yeah, opportunity. Yeah, do all sorts of exercises like that. And it's just really fun. It's just all about having fun, coming out, just being yourself. And how long have you been around? It, the Raise the Curtain. Oh, I just opened. I just opened in September. Okay. I didn't think I'd yeah, heard of it before. So. 
Yeah. So you are brand so it's gonna new. It's going to take me a while to grow. Yeah. We only have about nine kids right now, but hopefully that, that will, that will grow. Okay. So how do people find out about you and how do people uh, register? I guess you have to register. Yeah. So right now it's basically <laughs> just my Facebook page. I am doing a website right now. I'm not finished it yet, but so basically through my Facebook page, people will message me and we'll just chat from there and yeah, they come out to a trial class and we just take it from there. Is there an age restriction? Well, about nine to 10 to 16. It all depends on the child. Um, you know, a lot of nine year olds can memorize anything less you know it's, it's just hard it just depends on the child basically okay but i find i find that age nine or ten and up seems to be fitting in really well excellent i thought now i noticed on your facebook page too and i mean this is this all envelops it for sure you're going to be focusing on boosting uh self-esteem and confidence in each child yeah. and no experience is required <laughs> that's right yeah yeah we just want them to come out have fun be themselves and just really open up Excellent, excellent. What great opportunity. Children need something to do. And, you know, we've gone through COVID. Children need to be back together and do yeah. things, you know, burn nice off some you. energy. Yeah. Yeah. And I find that after COVID, a lot of kids are somewhat a little, you know, hesitant about being out and about because they were in for a long time. So there's a little bit of social, a social aspect going on there as well. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. You're absolutely correct about that for sure too. We've yeah. we've got to learn to get back out and be with each other again. Yeah, you know they were just thrown back into school, and and so this just gives them an opportunity to get out a little more, have some fun. And I mean, we still have to be careful, but for the last two years, it's like yes, go back to school or do what you need to do, but be so careful. We still need to be careful, but you know things are opening up a little bit, and we can and enjoy our our time together. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, once again, with me from Raise the Curtains, I've got Jen Stiles. Welcome to the Smith Falls area. I, I, I love the fact that you're, you know, the rubber hits the road. You're out there and you're helping our community and you're helping our children. Thank you very much for doing that. So to, oh, to, to learn more, how do people get a hold of you once again? On the Facebook page, Raise the Curtains. Awesome. And you are at our United Church at 41 Market Street here in Smith Falls. That's too. right. What night That's of the right. week? Yep. What what night of the week is Tuesday. it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Tuesdays from five thirty to seven thirty. Excellent. Well, thank yeah. you very much for joining us, and please keep in touch. We'll we'll keep doing this, and we'll learn more about raise the curtains here in Smith Falls. Great. Thank you so much.